This is the online version of the workshop, Organize Your Life. In this short video, you'll learn five tips for getting yourself organized and making great choices for being more productive. In our face-to-face -face workshop, we demonstrate some essential apps, tools, and browser extensions that make getting organized easier with whatever technology you use. After the video, be sure to check out those apps listed below and see the links to the articles that we've based our five tips on. So getting started, five tips to organization. Tip number one, manage your time rather than multitask. You may not realize it, but studies show that multitasking is not an effective way to do anything. We all know that you shouldn't text and drive. Taking your eyes off the road and looking at your phone is just plain dangerous and it causes accidents. While the stakes are decidedly lower while you're studying, doing research, or in class listening to a lecture, Multitasking is no less detrimental. If we're checking texts or social media or email, we're actually taking our minds off the task at hand. That's why it's recommended that you manage your time rather than multitask. Plan to focus on just one thing at a time for set, some set amounts of time, 20, 30, or 45 minutes, rather than jumping from one task to another. It will make you more productive in the long run. Tip two. Be realistic with your goals. When it comes to studying and writing, it's best to be realistic with yourself about how much you can achieve in a given amount of time. Now that you're going to stop multitasking, you may find that your time is much more efficient, but you should still make sure you allow the right amount of time for certain tasks. How quickly can you actually read a chapter out of a textbook? Does it take you 45 minutes? If that's the case, you can't actually read and understand eight chapters in a single night. How long does it take you to write a page from a research paper? Be sure to set yourself enough time to get quality work done. When you're realistic with your goals, you're going to feel more productive and accomplished as you get things done, rather than overwhelmed and bogged down if you've set yourself too much to do and not enough time to do it. Tip three, establish a routine for yourself. Routines are key to feeling organized. When you structure your day well and you do a few things the same way at the same time each day, you'll find yourself more at ease and more productive. Let's say this semester you have a class at 9 a.m. on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but nothing until noon on Tuesday, Thursday. As tempting as it is to sleep in on those later mornings, it's actually in your best interest to get up at the same time, eat at the same time, each day. Add a morning walk-in or tidying your space and you'll feel ready to accomplish your now realistic goals. Tip four has to do with the space you work in. Working in a space that's neat and tidy can actually help your productivity overall. A recent Harvard study looked at 100 undergraduate students and their work persistence whilst tidying, working in a tidy, organized desk versus a scattered and chaotic space. The results were clear. Students that were working in the neat and tidy space were actually able to concentrate on the given task for one and a half times as long. While the studies have shown that cluttered spaces may lead to more creativity, if you're actually just trying to accomplish a goal that needs more persistence, your best bet is to tidy up. Get into a routine of organizing and cleaning your workspace regularly to keep it from becoming an overwhelming task. And last but not least, Tip five is to plan time for yourself. Be sure that while you're planning your day or your study session, you plan time for yourself. Whether that's to take a walk or chat with a friend, scroll through social media, studies show that taking regular breaks are important to keeping your brain sharp. Without breaks, research shows that people have difficulty focusing on the task at hand, whereas people who take regular breaks were, are actually able to focus much longer. Even a brief diversion can dramatically improve productivity. The key, however, is to keep your breaks short and don't allow yourself to procrastinate with your breaks.